Hello everyone. Welcome to the very first JavaScript tutorial. In this tutorial, we will be looking at how do we write code in JavaScript, why JavaScript is required, and what other things we can do with JavaScript which are not possible with CSS and HTML. To begin with, uh, I have a simple HTML5 document layout here which says doc type HTML HTML head meta carset UTF-8 title JavaScript oops uh, it should be JavaScript tutorial 1 head body script and body close in HTML you must be familiar with the HTML layout but this thing this thing here is the JavaScript code to write JavaScript code first of all you enclose all the coding inside an opening script tag and a closing script tag now everything which is here is passed by the JavaScript engine of specific browser now you must have heard many a times that uh, your JavaScript runs on one browser but doesn't run on another or maybe it has a different behavior on another browser this is because different browsers have different JavaScript engines which have different parse methods though the uh, the native methods of JavaScript are identical in every browser but when it comes to libraries like jQuery then uh, these uh, engines of browsers clash among themselves and interpret the results in different ways that is the reason sometimes a JavaScript code works on one browser and sometimes it doesn't work on another okay so as I've already told you everything you write inside the script and the closing script tag will be executed by a special parser engine of the browser which would execute and uh, understand all the code inside here so first of all let's write a simple document dot write program which simply writes a bunch of text to the document to do that just do document dot write hello world this is our JavaScript hello world program now what it does here is document is the object okay let me show you first this okay mm, I don't know why it's taking some time to load uh, okay as you can see now what document dot write is doing is uh, this is the document this white area where you write all your HTML CSS code and it's get executed by the browser everything inside this white space is the document and the command is simple enough to understand JavaScript is doing document dot write that means JavaScript is telling the browser to write on this white space and what to write hello world so this was our hello world program for the JavaScript uh, you don't need any specifications for the JavaScript to write you just need a text editor I'm using sublime text uh, there are many text editors in the market like notepad plus plus or if you are uh, Mac or Linux there are other alternatives but I guess sublime, sublime text is very cool and I'll recommend sublime text to you though I also have notepad plus plus installed because I need it for some C or C plus plus code but sublime text is best for the web development <coughs> okay so why JavaScript is used in HTML, uh, you can do the layout of the web page. That means you can make a structured layout of what is visible to the user, add text, graphics, images, etc. With CSS, uh, you can style that document. That means uh, you can position the elements, uh, add colors, backgrounds, and so on. But with the help of JavaScript, you can basically interact with the client side that means you can uh, respond to the client 
on mouse events on click buttons on tapping on hovering and in mobile devices you have JavaScript events that occur when the user slides or scroll down and uh, so on like that so basically JavaScript is used to interact with user on the client side and do some major functions like transportation of form data validation automated process looping looping through events and like that so I guess I'll explain the, these events in the upcoming tutorials and in the next tutorial we'll be probably looking at uh, another object which is super global to the document object and contains all other events and default functions of JavaScript so don't forget to subscribe and uh, thank you for watching